What up, everybody? It's Luther here again, once again, bringing you another interview. Sit down with one of my guys. Um, <laughs> Kamari Robinson, man. Kansas City Chiefs, number 11. Hey, go go follow yeah. him on, on the gram. I'm trying to get used to this stuff, as you know. I'm still not a good social media guy, but here we are, and I'm trying to get better. Uh, so, my first question, thanks for uh, sitting down with me, as you, you know. Sure, Appreciate man. you, man. Um, first off, um, How's the season? How you, how you, how's the season going? I'm, you know, I've been coming to the games, checking y'all out, and um, what, what's your, what's, how do you feel so far? You know, y'all trying to make a, a playoff run. I know you locked in. Uh, tell me about what's going on. Shoot, sure, man. You know, trying to get back to the playoffs, like you talking about. You know what I mean? It's really all about just focusing there right now. We had some, um, some little ups and downs in the beginning of the season, but it's going pretty good right now. You know, coming off this um, good win, got the Broncos coming up this mm -hmm. Sunday. Mm -hmm. Come check us out, y'all. Hey, we just following now, that suit. <laughs> All right, now tell me something. What is D Rod? What? Is, how'd you get the nickname? Tell me your nickname, D Rod. Everybody call you D Rod, right? Nah, see, my uncle played ball before me, and everybody his name was Marcus Robinson. Yeah. My mama named me after him. Yeah. I'm D Marcus Robinson. So when he was in the league, he was like, "Man, they just start calling me M Rod." I got here, man. They start calling me D Rod. Mm -hmm. My nickname really bud though. They just gave you a nickname. They just gave it to me. That's so how I go to everybody get one. Everybody got a name, yeah. Um, um, like Cheetah, he ain't had that before you get in the league. Yeah. Now he Cheetah ten. He tell him. me about the tell me about <laughs> tell me about the chemistry y'all got, man. I know y'all got a uh, you know I, when I work you guys out, it's pretty mm -hmm. cool. To all you guys receivers and uh, the the relationships you guys got, it's, it's pretty it's pretty cool. Even on the sideline, y'all yeah. be out there turning up, y'all yeah. you know. So I get that same for man. Yeah, yeah, Come yeah. On, yeah. Man. Four quarter special. <laughs> nah, for real, for real though. Me and Ten came in together, so 2016 we got drafted here. So we've been here for the long run for six years now. And shoot, man. When you come in with a guy like that who got grind the same as you, about both from South Georgia, you know what I mean? You know we're trying to get somewhere because we came from a small town type. Yeah. So, shoot, once we get here, man, we're just trying to show everybody what we made of, what we can right. do. So, shoot, I, I, I feel like he doing a hell of a job doing that shit, man. Keep it up, Tim, boy. And shoot, me, I'm trying to get it started, man. What What is your goal for the second half of the season? What do you want to bring to the table to the team? I would say just, just more awareness, you know what I mean? Trying to get... That ball in my hand, for real. That's all I need a chance with that ball in my hand, dog. Go crazy, you know what I'm saying? Show, show what I could do. Show my elusiveness. So what I could do on that court. So what I could do on that field, I mean. I just got the court. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, hell no, nah, Hell no. Nah. <laughs> hell no. Nah, hell nah, nah. yeah. Just, just showing, just showing these, these people what I could bring to the table, man. I, I'm pretty sure they already know, but 10 a different animal. Cheetah, you know what I'm saying? They're not that fast or so. He get all the opportunities, which he should, for real. I need one or two. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh man! So not only are you a a, a, a great receiver, you also are a, a dad now. Yeah. Tell me about Thunder. Man, it's a wonderful thing. Uh, it's probably the best thing that ever happened to me for real. Having a um a little girl, Thunder Robinson. Hey, mama. Uh, man, got a beautiful she keep, wife. She keep you busy. Yeah, yeah, she does keep me busy. Her mom usually taking care of her like right now while I'm here hooping and talking with this guy. Uh, get my get my afternoon workout in. Nah, she she um she a lot, she a handful, but it, it's a blessing, man. That's all that's all I love. For Daddy, her. Daddy's girl, she yeah. will not let nobody nah, pick her up, uh -uh. but you know, but you yeah. or or her. Yeah, which is good. It's just like she is a daddy's girl. Yeah, man. I try I, I try to teach her to stay um stay away from the widows. So <laughs> hell <laughs> nah. You gotta tell her, hey, I'm the enforcer. Somebody try to take, you know, you, you wanna come to that day? She see, she see. You, you gonna come to that day? You, you know, somebody gonna be like, hey, man, I'm trying to take my daughter out. What you gonna do? No, hey, Uncle, hey. Uncle exactly. Luke. I need to pull up. Hey, I gotta pull up. Pull up. You know what I mean? <laughs> hey, you know, I'm silly up. and goofy, but you know, I got a dark side. You know what I mean? Sure. Watch out. Hey, all right. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm a thug. <laughs> this man, too funny, dog. Oh, man, so. Um, yeah, man, I'm a thug. Nah, I was playing. But real talk, nah. Um, what else you like, you know, like, uh, tell tell me something, like, uh, I usually ask people this, all the people I work with, I never really ask you this, but what is your why? Everybody has a why, and that why is subject to change, right? So, like, when you was in, like, for me, I give you an example, when I was growing up in high school, it was to get school, get a scholarship. My parents couldn't afford shit. So, it was it was to get my cost paid for, and then try to go to the NBA. That was my why. My why was every. It's always gonna be something in the why you do this. So what, what is the why? See, my why at first was I wanted to play for the Gators. That was my first why. Just wanting to play for the Gators mm -hmm. and Gator Trump in the end zone when I scored. So that was my first why. I feel when I why I played ball so hard 
Then I got here, and like I said, I got a daughter now. That's my main mm-hmm. reason why now. But uh, yeah, I got a family, man. Just trying to take care of them, trying mm-hmm. to um, show show the kids back home that it's it's possible, honestly, to do whatever you want to put your mm-hmm. mind to. You could do it. Um, let them know that um, they, they mm-hmm. don't shortchange yourself. Um, learn everything you you trying to learn or you trying mm-hmm. to do in life, and I feel like that that makes life more easier as as you as you learn as you go. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So. You gotta take mistakes, take the right mistakes, and then learn from the mistakes. So, yep. That's what uh, I mean. Who's the best dresser? You got you, Ten, Miko, and Kels. Who's the best dresser? I ain't gonna lie. Kels, Kels probably got the most <laughs> swag. Kels got the most swag for sure. Y'all boys be coming with the He got the most the money though, man. He got he got the most money, so I, that's why he got the most swag. Like, come on. After that, then it's me. <laughs> yeah. See, cause y'all, these boys with this fashion, boy, this is y'all do, huh? Y'all, y'all love that fashion. I'm, you know it. I be seeing them little pictures. I'm like, dang, I don't even know what y'all got on, but it look man. good. You know, I'm like, okay. I, man, I put I'm this like, on and I got, I'm, I got, I'm fashionable. You know what I uh, mean? I got Luther Club on that. And that's hard. look at this guy. Come on now, but hey. I, I make it fashionable. So I think <laughs> I'm the fashionable. Style. Y'all get on. You can. I make, I make it fashionable. The clothes don't make. Hey, it. y'all hear that? So Kels, yeah. <laughs> Kels. 10 and Miko. He said he the faster one. Uh-huh. Second gonna be Kels. So that means 10 and, and Miko is somewhere at 34. I ain't gonna, you know what I'm saying? They're my dogs, though. You know what I'm saying? But the fashion goes to they you. They tied. They tied. They tied the <laughs> third place. Oh, man. This dude here. Um, yeah, so my last question to you, because I know you got things to do, and I appreciate you sitting down with me, For sure. is what is your overall goal? You overall know, how, goal? Like, how many more years you want to play in the league, and then after you're done in the league, what you want to do? I'm trying to get paid. Hey, that's real. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to hey, you. I ain't gonna lie to hey, you. Hey, Eric, that's the goal. Hey, right? I won the Super Bowl. I've been a two. I'm trying to get to another one this year with the guys. Then I'm trying to get paid. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get that money in my pocket so I could do this even more at, at an even more high level. You know what I mean? But nah, uh, big goal for real just to um, set a name for myself and for my family and for the crib. I'm from South Georgia, Peach County, so it's small town. Probably nobody heard of it, but yeah, just trying to set an example. That's my go-to right now. Trying to set an example for the kids and for my family, man. Gotcha. That's my wife. That's what's up, man. I appreciate your time, man. My guy, it's D. Rob once again. He's yes, crazy, as silly as y'all see. And now I just found out he's the most fashionable. Although I'm the one that got the most swag. Everybody know when I pull up, I might have on some. I'm glad, y'all. I'm glad y'all can't <laughs> see these ankles right now, cause boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is stupid. All right, man. I appreciate y'all. <laughs> check out my check out this link. Click subscribe. All that fun stuff. Done.